I decided to try this scary game with The last thing I told you was Don't go through the woods. And what do we do with this idiot? I guess she didn't want to listen. Oh! Scared me. It's stuck. It's stuck. Oh, great. I unlocked the door above. Eh. Is that the. About a year ago, I crossed through this place. They told me I would never come back alive, but I did. You may or may not remember what was happening before I put you in this place, but right now, that doesn't really matter. What matters now is what is this place. The shack was built in this 18th century? I don't know. 10th, yeah, 18th? Some say, no, I don't know. I don't know. Some say strange things happen over here, but the truth is that this was built as an experiment. People were put into this shack to find a solution to their sickness problems back then. However, their souls remain in the building, claiming for their taken lives. This is not a joke, and it is not a test. I put you in this shack to test you. This is not a joke, and this, and it's not a test. I put you in this shack to test you. Really now. If you have the will to survive, you will do so, but fresh air isn't close to you yet. If you can pass through this shack, my second test will be awaiting your soul uh, awaiting for your soul. This can be a dark place, but darker is what I have in mind for you, and I did waste all my time to take to make you away from the exit room. You don't know who I am. But I do know who you are, and what your limits are. Oh, creeper. Okay. Needs key. Oh, oh, look at that. I have a key. I have a remote. I need batteries for that remote. Needs key. Awesome. Boop. No power off. Oh. I have been thrown in here with other seven people. I don't get no, I don't get what is happening, but we all have the il this illness they, that they name flu. And I can see why they name it like that. John, the most known farmer of the Shadowgrass camps, felt like us a couple days ago, and now he has been vomiting a black substance that stinks really bad. That doesn't sound like the flu. That sounds terrible. <laughs> what they are doing is not human. We haven't received any food for more than five days now, and I believe they forgot about us. As long as you have water, you can survive for a while. Maria, who has been pouring blood from her nose and her ears, and we are all dying. Nine days pass, and we are all dying. <laughs> John died, and his body is spilling a horrible smell. How much till I'm gone? I'm sure they all know what is happening outside this building, but we don't. But we don't. Why am I, Why are we here? It's a question I ask myself every day. It's background noise, like, freaking me out. Okay. We can't tolerate the smell, and we are all almost gone, and only, the only survivors are me and Marco Centauro. The town is small, and I never heard about him. But he does have the, but he doesn't have the illness. I doubt why. Not even a single symptom. Not even a single headache. He came with me and the others. Oh, you know where my soul arises. Wall, wall is keys. Die. Wall is keys. Ha. Oh, not getting that with my hands. Look at that. Yeah. It's full of blood. No shit. Further. Use this. Oh, I forgot fancy key right there. 
Factory to pick it up? Uh, what am I doing? Okay, what well, was this key? Die. Well, it's really creepy. Oh, it's locked. Close. Oh. Yeah, I know what you mean, dude. I... Okay. Oh, wait. Where did... Oh. Need another freaking battery. Oh, I want to do something on here. I want to figure this out. What am I supposed to do? Did I miss something in here? And just sat on the floor there saying a word and all. I guess Marcus Centaur is his name. We have other names in our we have other names in our bed. He looks at me every time and I don't know what to think. Why isn't he sick as I am? Is he different? I guess I'll never know because I don't know how much time left I have in this world. Something I would like to know is what is there any cure to this disease and I bet Marco knows about it. I've seen him looking at his wrist and pressing his neck with his fingers. Does that mean something? He's checking his pulse. <laughs> I'm dying. I can't tolerate the pain of the hungerness, and I'm also vomiting as my fellows did and before they were dead. I don't have the faith to continue, but something forces me to write on this diary. Something is telling me to write. I knew it. Marco is cutting his finger with the only cabinet we have and his blood is darker than anything I saw before. I'm sure it's a kind of experiment, but then why me? Can you explain it yet? I feel my time is running out. I will die soon. It's all the daylight. Some medics entered through the only door I have, and they took Marco out. They treated me really bad. I just want to go out, but they didn't let me. I guess what I can do now is stop writing this diary and let people know about what happened. In the main Moonblast Shack. I hope my memory survived the years. I would have liked to see the sun once more, but we didn't have but we don't have any windows in the building. I curse the shack here. I will live for the rest of my days and even when my soul arises. Okay, I got the keys out of the wall. Like some other hidden thing. What do I do? Okay. <clears throat> so I went and kind of cheated. So I had to look because I was so. I didn't know what to do. So. Ah. Okay. Oh. Which one is still locked? Is it this one? Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Okay, another battery. Okay, how do I turn that? I think I can do s I don't think something to Oh. Dang it. Okay. It works now. Oh. Lost. Oh. You used the finger. Okay. Oh, well, maybe I should have stayed in the shack. I have not run into the sewers, like a dirty sewer bed. 
Okay, guys, so this is game Arise. Um, I guess I'm gonna play the second one. Let's play Arise 2. Click here. Oh, did I click it? Balls. Okay, well, this is gonna Arise 1. I will be back with Arise 2, and I'll see you guys later.